It's Megan. As always, I hope everybody is doing wonderful. Today is going to be a very exciting video. I'm going to be doing the unboxings of two ultimate unicorn bags for me. I'm very excited about this. I did just get back from Hawaii. I celebrated my 13 year wedding anniversary with my husband. That might be why I'm kind of in the Aloha spirit wearing an Aloha shirt. <laughs> But we had a wonderful time and I wanted to say thank you to every single person that said happy anniversary on Instagram. That was very kind and much appreciated. I also wanted to mention in my last video, I did do the Louis Vuitton giveaway announcement and congratulations to those winners. And to all of you that did enter, I just wanted to say thank you myself because your energy of fun and excitement really got into my spirit for the few weeks that I did do that giveaway and I'm definitely looking forward to doing the next. So let's get into the unboxing, shall we? <laughs> this came in two nights ago. I had been waiting for ACL's associate to contact me and he did when I got back from Hawaii, which was perfect timing. <laughs> so it is the Louis Vuitton Giant Monogram Speedy Bandolier. I am thrilled over this. When my SA did pull this bag out, I literally felt like a five-year-old on Christmas morning. <laughs> I had that feeling. I love the reverse on the side. I'm a big fan of the reverse monogram. I find it different. Love the coffee shade. I am going to get my initial stamped right here in gold. I love the fact that this is monogram canvas, just big and giant icons. It's different, it's unique and gorgeous. I had already placed the key lock that came with the bag and happy to say that this padlock is the shiny kind. A lot of the speedies do have the ones that tarnish over time, but yay, this is the shiny one. So I plan on wearing this a bit dressed up sometimes by maybe letting the keys hang out like that. I think this look is beautiful. Now it does have the bandolier strap, as you guys can see. The vachetta is an aged vachetta. The inside is so beautiful because it's very unique and different. We have some stuffing in here. Uh, it's a black interior. And I'm guessing that all of these bags were made in France. This bag was, and hopefully I can get it to appear on camera. Yes, made in France. So yes, guys, I'm ecstatic to have this bag and I just can't wait to use it. So yay, this is my unicorn bag and I have it and I'm very happy. It's truly not the materialistic stuff in life that makes you happy. I've emphasized that on my channel many times. It's the free gifts that God does give us that completes our heart. But it is nice to enjoy things in life while we're here because life is very short. So as long as we keep a humble perspective, a humble attitude, I think there's nothing wrong with enjoying nice items like this. So my next unboxing is going to be shown in Hawaii. I did film that on the balcony of our hotel room. So I'm going to be showing you some short footage and at the end there is some inspiration and I'd like to elaborate on that inspiration in my next video. If you guys have any comments or questions on this Speedy 30 Bandolier in the giant monogram canvas, please do leave them in the comments below as I do love reading and responding to your comments. I did not have a microphone on me, so it might not be as loud as it is now, so perhaps hiring the volume would help with this part of the video. So here we are onto the second unboxing unicorn bag. Let's go. Now that's the clearest water I've ever seen in my life. 
It's so beautiful. We got here yesterday. We're on the island of Oahu. We're here celebrating our wedding anniversary. And we're staying North Shore in Oahu, which is 45 minutes north of Waikiki. And I did bring my Palm Springs Mini in the reverse monogram canvas. And I am wearing it with the strap that came with my Pochette Matisse in the reverse monogram canvas. This is a great bag when you're just carrying essentials for travel. So headed to Louis Vuitton. I have no idea which bag I'm going to get. So you guys will find out what that is soon, even though I don't know right now. But I'm excited. Of course, I'm going to Louis Vuitton. to go to dinner for our anniversary and I have to make this pretty quick because our reservations are in 15 minutes. I'm bringing my toiletry 26 and I'm using it as a clutch tonight. Wanted to do this unboxing for you guys and this is literally the best Louis Vuitton piece I've ever purchased and I can't believe that I was able to get it. I did bring luggage tags before I came because I know that they will not give you replacement pieces while you are here. It's very hard to do. Uh, so, I got three of them. Got the Demi Urban with the pink Hawaii logo. And it's so pretty, and it has the heart on the back. And I love Hawaii, it means so much to me. I've been coming here since I was 19 with my husband, so it really means a lot to me. And then I also got the uh, Vachetta Classic with gold, which is very pretty. And it does have a gold part on the back as well. And lastly, this one is the black luggage tag. And as you can see, there's silver at the top. Kind of a silver gold tone flower, which I think looks really pretty. And then she did the heart on the back as well. Beautiful items to bring home and be forever remembered for this trip. Okay, are you ready? Here we go. <laughs> Yay! Here we go. They do say dynamite does come in small packages. <laughs> Very true. So, we shall unbox this. Ribbon off. Are you ready? <sighs> so excited. I can't even believe it. It was so beautiful when I first saw it, and in person, it's even more beautiful. It's the Louis Vuitton, I know I'm gonna pronounce it wrong, Boit Chapeau Souple. Uh, I'll figure that out, absolutely I will, but Boit Chapeau Souple. I did try this one on in the store in the Monogram Classic Canvas, and I really like the fit. I absolutely love the luggage tag in the front. I love the reverse canvas. I've always been a big fan of that, ever since I got my reverse canvas, uh, Le Matisse. And then it does come with a strap, uh, and I tried it on crossbody as well as shoulder style. Loved it, fell in love. And it also does come with a key padlock on the inside. And it's the shiny kind. So it'll look very beautiful once I close this up right here and have the little old lock right there. But extremely excited to have this. And then it also has black interior. And I have to say, I was very excited because I was looking at the other ones and the manager said all of these pieces were basically made in France. Well, I looked at this piece and it said made in Italy, and that really meant a lot to me because I am half Italian. My dad, uh, who did pass away, was Sicilian. So it means a lot to me that this piece was made in Italy, and it's so gorgeous. It's my favorite. I've never been so excited about a purchase in my entire life. I'll do a what's in my bag when I get home, you guys, but very excited to have this. And because our reservations are literally like now, <laughs> uh, I am going to have to make this short but sweet, but I do want to let you guys know because I do have this on my mind. I am on vacation right now. I'm looking out at the ocean. It's gorgeous. I do think when we're on vacation, we tend to enjoy every single moment because we're just savoring it. We're on vacation. We're getting away from our problems and all of that. But 
I truly think that we should live our lives in a way that every single day when we get up, we wake up with a grateful spirit and enjoy every single moment, every single day. You don't need to be on vacation to experience happiness in your mind because happiness truly is not a destination. It's a place in your mind. It's where you put your mind. It's peace. If you have peace in your mind, you have happiness. So that's what I have to say about that. Happiness is definitely a state of mind, not a destination. Beautiful place here, very spiritual, but we can have that same peace of mind. Carry that feeling in our hearts. So very glad to have this piece. Can't wait to use it in the future. And wonderful commemorative piece to bring home from my anniversary trip. So that's going to be it. If you guys have any questions about this bag whatsoever, let me know and I will be sure to respond, and then also what I touched on with happiness being a state of mind and not a destination, please let me know as well. All right guys, off to dinner, uh, a little bit late here, so that'll be it. Thank you guys so very much for watching my unboxing, and until next time.